Alright, we're going to move into the second half very quickly, but if you joined me in pregame, you heard me say that Luke Frank Hansen, number 17 for Kyle Tununat for Greenland, was this tournament's top scorer coming into today. She has gone 0 for 5 in shooting this game. She's missed a 7 meter. She's missed 4 shots from open play. She is scoreless. Another side for Puerto Rico. You've also heard me say Natalie Ceballos does not miss. She is 6 of 8, if my math is correct, shooting this game. Puerto Rico's up 8. Greenland in black. Puerto Rico in, right, in white. Tickets to Spain on the line. Berga. Got God. Berga. 1-2 here, looking to gain momentum. Langa, Langa goes in for herself, gets it through. Refs. Going to say... Foot fault there. And go... <laughs> Excuse me. Bjerga throws it away. That is Greenland's 10th turnover. A bit uncharacteristic for them. Puerto Rico is trying to add to her lead here in the second half because it's a long game and a goal lead is nothing with 30 minutes on the clock. Gerardo met double dribbles there. Maybe some nerves to start the second half. Maybe some cold hands. Maybe some cold wax. Biaga, Langa, met by Gerardo. No call, says the ref. Puerto Rico is going the other way. It's 3 3 Sirius Garcia. Stops and makes Gagar keep moving. It's wide open for her. And Puerto Rico is up nine. Like I said, the winner of this game is the winner of this tournament. And the winner of this tournament goes to the World Championships this December in Spain. And at the World Championships in Spain this December. Whoever wins this game has to start that World Champions against, I don't know, the 2019 World Champions... Netherlands team. Passing to Ivana Holm here. Seven meter earned there by Ivana Holm. She crashed hard. She looks like she's favoring her shoulder a little bit, but she's okay because that's nothing new for her. Looks like we're switching the seven meter shooter here for Greenland. It's going to be Andrea Harriman. Save! Sugeli Soto! Puerto Rico can't control the ball. And it's outside throw right near my table. And Greenland maintains possession. Puerto Rico is extending the defense a little bit out to nine meters, trying to make Greenland work for it. Thank you. Stolen! <laughs> by Puerto Rico. Goal! Scored there by number eight, Joanne Vergara. Puerto Rico's got a 10-goal lead. 
And if you told me coming in that either of these teams would have a lead more than five in this game, I would be wondering if you saw these two teams all week. Zico Fuentes can't hold on to an interception here with the action. Langa cross with Berger. Berger tries to shoot, saves Ugeli Soto. And Zugeli Soto, who came on at the start of the second half, has three quick saves in three and a half quick minutes. In Puerto Rico, I believe, has control of the board. Graziani at right wing. Ceballos with him to cross. Ceballos finds the second pivot. Sheila Gerardo! Oh my goodness. Oh, that was pretty. Pretty movement by Sheila Rado. And Greenland's going to talk it over. Up 11. Thirty-four minutes and twelve seconds elapsed. Puerto Rico up eleven. This Greenland team's got to get something going. They've been, they, Puerto Rico is on a six to zero scoring run. Last few minutes of the first half up to now. Vanna home with the cross, cross second cross in the backcourt. Got guarded, Berger in the middle. Berger tries to take on Graziani. Swing to the wing, Anya Hellman. I'm sorry, Andrea Hellman scores her first. In all tournament, we saw this Greenland team score from the wings, and it doesn't look like that's happening so much now. That's only the wings have only had, from that count, eight shots. That could be wrong. It could be nine, but it's not what not what we expected with this offense coming into this game. Gerardo to Malnado. Matt High finds Ceballos. Ceballos thinks she's through. Goes for it. That's are going to say free throw only. Maldonado, Hirado, skip past the Fuentes, Fuentes likes to shoot though, save Nifi Floyd. Stolen Natalie Ceballos before I can even look up, Ceballos with speed, gets around the defender. And Natalie Ceballos is on cloud seven. Seven goals for Ceballos. Lost pass by Greenland. And I can't believe what I'm seeing right now. To be perfect, quite honest with you. Puerto Rico is executing their game plan to perfection. And Greenland is helping them in the process. With unforced errors. Now the Ceballos works her way through, beats her defender. Greenland trying to break quickly. Hammond just works through, earns a free throw. And Greenland's got to get something going. They got to get something going soon. Home. Got guard. Berger down the middle. Met quickly. Pass swing. Pass to the corner. Nothing doing. Swing it back around. Got guard. Berger. Mickelson. Second pivot in. 
Berge finds Mickelson. Gagar is going to try and take it herself. Then go to the wing. Ref is saying there is nothing there. And that is another turnover for Greenland. I thought Greenland may have had that. I thought Gagard may have had the pass to uh, Heinemann on the wing. Anya Heinemann. Yeah, Anya. I got it that time. But she went in, and the ref decided to let the play on. Maldonado. Maldonado! Maldonado was hidden on the right wing all tournament, and now she's playing right back, and it's working for Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico's speed is tearing this Greenlandic defense to shreds. Greenland running their offense. Gadgard, Mikkelsen. Mikkelsen tries to find Gadgard. Broken up by Arado. Say stolen Puerto Rico. Graziani down the middle. Graziani scores her fourth of the evening. Eight and a half minutes gone by in this second half. And that eight goal lead that Greenland had that Greenland was suffering at halftime. The eight goal deficit that Greenland had at halftime. The eight goal lead that Puerto Rico had at halftime is now 14. Ceballos almost with a steal. Pass to the wing. Hyman saves Soto. Puerto Rico controls it. Cedis Garcia checks in at pivot. Puerto Rico is going to slow the game down right now. No need to rush. Pivot out. Pass to Cedis Garcia over to Rodriguez. Maldonado in the middle. Maldonado tries to find Cedis Garcia. It's defended by Luca Frank Hansen. Puerto Rico is going to try and get something going. Hansen. God God. Hansen. Hansen. Save. Zugeli Soto. And look at Frank Hansen still hasn't scored in this contest. And if you told me that coming in, I would have stopped listening to you after you said one of these teams would have a 10-goal lead in this game. Garcia. Maldonado, Rodriguez down the middle with some pace. Back to Maldonado. Maldonado's got a dribble working around to Ceballos. Ceballos got it by Gagard, now by Hall. Gets it to Maldonado in the middle. Not a lot of space there for much of anything. Foul. It's clean. It just looked a little weird. Looks like Maldonado lost her feet there for a second. But Puerto Rico gets a free throw. He's going to try it again. Ceballos calls the movement. Passive play is up. Ceballos in the series. Garcia, series. Garcia. Is not stopped. Unstoppable. Five goals for Sirius Garcia. Berge tries to break through free throw only. Too many steps by Berge on the attack. Sirius Garcia is saying something to our team. 4-2 defense here from Puerto Rico. Gadgard trying try to find Mainke in the pivot. They find her. She shoots. It's a 7 meter. I'm sorry. That's Ivana Holm. My apologies. And look at Frank Hansen is trying to break the duck and score her first of the evening. There it is. That's her first goal in seven attempts. But right now, Greenland will take whatever they can get to get the momentum back in their favor. But Greenland sticking back in a 6-0. Ceballos saying do something else with this. Maldonado gets, tries to get back to Ceballos. They're way too close to the defense. They're easy steal for Greenland. Home finds Gagard in the middle. Gagard. 
puts it low, puts it in. Josephine. Got God. And Puerto Rico didn't like what they saw in that last sequence. I think they saw what I saw. Offense is getting a little too close to the defense for comfort. Not enough room to make space for themselves. Maybe try and keep the team focused. Maybe try to keep the team ready. Maybe try and keep the team laser-eyed on the goal of finishing this off. So that tomorrow morning they can begin the preparation for Netherlands, for Sweden, for the fifth place team out of the Asian Championships. While we have this moment on behalf of USA Team Handball, I'd like to thank Quick Play, Molten, the Verizon, our sponsors and partners. I'd like to thank the city of Elgin, Elgin, excuse me, my apologies, in Elgin Parks and Rec for allowing us to host this event in this venue at this time. It feels good to be back around handball. It's been a while. I'm enjoying it. I miss the smell of resin. The sounds of plastic towels. Not going to miss cleaning the resin or picking up the tape or putting away the towels, but right now I'm enjoying this and I hope you are too, no matter who you're rooting for. Timeout is over. We are back in action. Lots of crossing here in the backcourt. Maldonado over to the wing. Graziani is saved. Nivi Floyd, it's outside throw though. It's going to stay with Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico's going to take another crack at it. Maldonado. Rodriguez, skip pass to the wing. Tushila Harado finds the top corner. You can't place a shot better than that. Hudson. Gadgard finds the wing. Sugeli Soto is wise to it. Nothing is working for Greenland. And it seems like almost everything is working for Puerto Rico. And that's reflected in the scoreline. Greenland's back in the 6-0. Hirado. The Rodriguez finds the wing. Fuentes takes it. Shoots it. Saved if he float. Greenland. Come back the other way with some pace. Berge shoots. Saves the easy Soto yet again. Should mention that most of the starting lineup, if not all the starting lineup, my notes are unclear on this, uh, play for a while or got their start or they, they have experience playing together, not just on this Puerto Rican national team, but at Guerrilleros de Rio Grande. And many of these players on this Puerto Rican national team have been training or playing in Spain in recent years. Bad fall there by Sheila Rado. We're about to see a two minute penalty. To Ivana home for the push. She's saying, I did not push her like that. That's some simulation. That's some other stuff. But the ref is having none of it. And Puerto Rico has a player advantage. Exactly what Greenland didn't need if they wanted to get back in this one. Geraldo, set shot, save Nivy Floyd. Greenland, down a player, can't break. They're going to pull their goalkeeper. Nivy Floyd is going to take a bench. Sandro Rothberg is going to check in. And Nivy Floyd has seven saves. She's performed admirably today, but Reno, the, the, having multiple goalkeepers is a thing in handball, and Reno Lorenzen is 
definitely missed by this Green Lantern team. Anyway, back to the action. Berge to the left. Finds some space. Goal scored there by number three, Andrea Harman. Her second in seven attempts. Fourteen minutes and forty seconds left to go before the end of regulation. That's how long Greenland has to get back in this. Ortiz will take the shot through the legs and in. Goal scored there by number Viente Cuatro, number 24, Robles Ortiz. Hansen, Berger. Looks like Greeley is playing out in the 4 2. Yeah, Berge finds Hansen across the middle. She's going to shoot that. Save Soto. Saved by uh, Greenland. Greenland's going to get a second shot at this. Gadgard in the middle looking for space. Rothberg is being held on the line. Gadgard tries to shoot from the wing. Save again. Zugeli Soto. In the first half, it was Roxana de Carasquilla with six saves for this Puerto Rico team. And about 16 and a half minutes of play, Zugeli Soto has racked up nine. Gerardo. Ceballos back to Gerardo down the middle. Such shot, save Nivi Floyd. Such a quick shot, not sex shot, excuse me. And it looks like number 11, Alanis Benitez, has come in to mark Loki Frank Hansen out of the match. Forcing Green into play. Five reply. Teams are even again. How it met, wrapped up. She gets through anyway, and she scores as Andrea Harriman. Puerto Rico's very much content to take their time setting this offense up. Gerardo in the middle. Gerardo tries to find Maldonado. Finds nothing but the tarp. Bad pass there by Nivi Flood. No one from Puerto Rico was wise to it, so Greenland will maintain possession here. Hyman through the middle to Gadgar. Breakthroughs. Goal scored near post by Josephine Gadgar. Her third goal and four shots. And we're under 12 minutes, and it's a 12-goal lead, so it's about that time where if you've got a deficit, you have to play absolutely perfect handball the rest of the way. 12 minutes, at least 12 goals. Ideally, nothing but stops the rest of the way. Horado finds the bias wide open. Great work from the lateral movement. Ball is broken up there. Pass is broken up there by number eight, Joanne Vergara. Guy guard, footfall. Puerto Rico trying to break quickly. Ah, through the hands of Robles Ortiz. And it's going right back to Greenland. Frank Hansen gets it back to Heidemann. Heidemann tries to go through herself. Goal scored there by number three, Andrea Heidemann. Her fourth. Ten twenty-three left to go. And you're going to start to see longer and longer offenses from Puerto Rico unless the space is wide open. Greenland staying in their 6-0. Trying to defend against the lateral quickness of this Puerto Rican team. They're not here to shoot around over you. They're here to shoot around you or get by you. 
Shido Ortiz tries to go through the green lighted defenders. Earns a free throw. I'm sorry, Sheila Geraldo, my apologies. My apologies for that. Puerto Rico's ball. Spiders and Arado for pass. Puerto Rico is going to take a timeout to let me catch my breath. I thank them for that. I'm pretty sure there's a better reason for that timeout. They're going to work on some things. Make sure that they're running the offense they want to run for the next 9 minutes and 34 seconds. And while we're here during this timeout, I'm here to let you know that... The action is not done here for the United States at the conclusion of this one. Following our gold medal ceremony here, starting at 10 p 10 30 p.m. Eastern Time. Stay up for that one, folks. 7 30 p.m. Pacific Time. Uh, we've got IHF NHCHC. Uh, wait, 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 I can do this properly. IHF Super Globe NHCHC North American Qualification. Basically, the IHF Super Globe is the World Championships of Club Handball. And we've got three men's teams out there in Fremont, California, trying to find their way to be uh, North America's representative in that Club World Championship. And at 10.30 p.m. tonight, we've got Club Ministros of Nuevo Leon, Mexico, taking on the 2019 USATH National Champions, San Francisco Cal. He passed a play here as I'm going to do the promo. Sheila Gerardo says, don't forget my name with her fifth, 30 to 17 in favor of Puerto Rico. Gadgard coming the other way. Can't find anything. Held up by Sheila Gerardo. Free throw. I'm going to finish the promo now. Club Ministros in Nuevo León contra San Francisco Cal Heat, 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time, 7.30 p.m. Pacific on SuperGlobe2021.com. Winner of that tournament will go to Daman, Saudi Arabia this October for the Club World Championships, which is called the Super Globe. See how Back to the action. Hansen from 10 meters. Carrasquillo is wise to it. Well defended shot from Puerto Rico. I just felt something deflate in this in this building. It just got five degrees colder. Gerardo, Ceballos, right through the middle. That is her 10th goal of this gold medal game. 83.3% shooting percentage. Now at least Ceballos does not miss. Been saying it all week. All week. Gadgard, wide open space. Takes advantage. Her fourth. In the defense here, Gerardo takes it herself. We got two minutes here for the push. Ref is saying open push, two hands there by Valabaga. Trying to slow down this Puerto Rican team, they couldn't do it. 726 left. Or Rubenes Ortiz. Easy goal there for Puerto Rico. Greenland pulling the goalkeeper playing 6 feet 6. Aviana Kiyama puts that one wide. <laughs> Puerto Rico is going to give some instructions to their pivot. Actually, they're going to switch the pivots here as they play on. Puerto Rico doesn't even realize the pivot's missing. Graziani saved if he flew it. And again, I'm not saying Nivy Floyd isn't up to the task. Nivy Floyd has not had a bad game. But Rena Lorenzen is an excellent goalkeeper. 
and not having her to spell Nevi Floyd, not having her in the game has given Puerto Rico, and a, Puerto Rico a host of shooting opportunities they wouldn't have otherwise. Shot there from number two, Nunumri Lucasson saved by Carasquillo. Greenland will get a second chance on offense here. Heilman from the back, off the post. And Greenland will get another shot. Gadgard here on the right. Heilman back to Gadgard. Wing is open. Nunu Marie Lucasen gets it through the arm and leg of Carasquillo. The lead is 13, and we're under six minutes. It would take something uh, very fantastical for Greenland to win this game. Puerto Rico looking to finish it out. Uh, turnover there from Greenland. Created by Greenland, by Puerto Rico. Greenland unable to break. Heilman through the middle. Quick shot off the post, off the defender's leg. It's going to remain Greenland's ball. Hammond to guide guard over to Lucasen. Lucasen back to Hammond. Hammond tries to get to the pivot, does do so. Ivana home scores her fifth goal of the evening. Puerto Rico is in complete control and Puerto Rico is up 12 and Puerto Rico can smell the paella emanating from Spain and Puerto Rico is ordering game footage of the Netherlands to study and Sheila Arado is trying to find Ali Ceballos stolen players on the ground Gadgard picks it up she doesn't want this to end yet Logan well, Frank Hansen doesn't want this to end yet there she is. Look at Frank Hansen finally gets a shot going from the backcourt. The stop is right now. <laughs> the stop is right now is for a wet court. We're just going to dry this up very quickly. Second reminder while this court is being dry. Club Ministros versus San Francisco Cal here, 2019 USATH National Champions, Superglobe2021.com, 10 p.m. Eastern, 7.30 p.m. Pacific. I think that's 5.30 p.m. in Hawaii, so aloha, anyone from Hawaii joining in, make sure to check that out. But first, we've got to finish this off, this gold medal game. Ceballos, Hidalgo in the middle, back to Ceballos. Behind the back to Fuentes. That's a planned play. Nevi Floyd is wise to it. Nevi Floyd's 10th save. Greenland pulling their goalkeeper playing 6v6 offensively. Finds Ivana home in the pivot. Lobs. Carasquillo can't get to it in time. And the lead is 10. We're nearing three minutes of time left to play in this one. Three minutes of time left in the Norca. Maybe the longest three minutes for Puerto Rico. Try and maintain this lead. Pass behind the back to Sirius Garcia. Turnover. Berger. Gets by Ceballos off the post. They're going to say seven meters for the foul on Ceballos. Clock is ticking. Two minutes, 30 seconds left to go. Lord Gifford Hansen will take the seven meter. Clock is, refs are not stopping the clock. Not even think about stopping the clock. Lord Gifford Hansen buries it without a First thought, nonetheless, the second thought. Go Lead is nine. Number 17, 
But we are down to the final two minutes and Puerto Rico is starting to believe they are going back to the World Championships. They are going to Spain. Ceballos, met by Ivano Holm, finds Gerardo Rado, gets by Gagard, breaks through and scores. Go Puerto Rico. Lead is 10, ball stolen by Rodriguez. Dran Vergara takes it. No, there's no space there. Dran Van Vergara pushed. I don't know if that was simulation or not. She's going to sub out anyway. Refs aren't doing anything about it. Refs are saying play on. That's exactly what the refs said. Please play on. Please play on. Minute 12 left to go. Maldonado, who's been huge at back this game after playing all tournament at wing, earns the 7 meter. As we enter the final minute of this gold medal game. And the Puerto Rican team is starting to celebrate on the bench. Erica Graziani trying to end this one on a good note. Scores it. Her fifth goal. And Greenland must feel heartbroken to go undefeated in group stage and to lose in this fashion to Puerto Rico. But they've played their ball, their hearts out all weekend. The ball is into Ivana Home goal scored there by Ivana Home. Her seventh. They've played their hearts out all tournament. This Greenland team, and to come up this short must be frustrating for them. But this Greenland team will be back. Shot wide by Sheila Harada, but it will not matter. Puerto Rico has won the 2021 NHCHC Norca. And Puerto Rico is going to Spain. Stick around with us because we're going to have the medal ceremonies and the announcement of the All-Star team. Congratulations to Puerto Rico. And thank you everyone for watching with us. Congratulations to Puerto Rico. Great performance all tournament there by Greenland. Stick around, watch the medal ceremony. My name is Brian Cothorn and I am out.
I don't know which which, where, which way is the front. So they're all going to be facing you. Like, they're going to go to that table and then bring it to the team that are over there. That's what I'm doing. First and third. First and third. And then. Okay.